but 3,465 students applied to DPA. 3,465 students. There are 477 of you matriculated. Here's your um, Nikki Mayo, who graduated in 2001. She is a multimedia journalist specializing in social media strategies and promo videos for Nikki Mayo News. She resides in the Baltimore, D.C. region and began her journalistic career in Central New York reporting for NPR and WABR-FM, which um, is right here on campus. I'm Nikki Mayo, and I'm a multimedia journalist. So my day-to-day -day is I'm finally at the point in my career where I have some variety. I start the day, my nine to five is I'm a federal contractor for one of those three letter agencies in DC. And I'm a communication specialist. So I'm writing technical stories about all things transportation, okay? You know, like uh, how to stay safe in the streets and the trains and the planes and everything like that. And then it's when that work is done that I can do all the fun stuff that I'll probably talk more about today, which comes from my whole journal life, which is my hashtag that I'm always using. So I do everything from direct live events, because, you know, COVID wouldn't let us be great. So we had to stay inside, but we had to still communicate, right? I also will produce videos uh, for clients, whether they be, most of my clients are equity-based. They have a, you know, they have a meaning to their, their uh, excuse me, outreach. But sometimes it's for a hair care product, who knows? I know how to do all the fun, razzle dazzle stuff on EW Creative Suite, so I make, I make stuff pop. I also edit people's podcasts that they want. I really don't try to do those because not everybody's good podcasting. <laughs> and then um, last but not least, I run social media campaigns, which I have loved working in that particular space because having an active voice online that is great with the messaging of whatever the client wants or whatever their advocacy issue is, is such a good skill and talent that you all should consider honing and going into. It's a way to bring together your love for those TikTok videos and make some money off of it while also benefiting the good of everyone else. I want everyone to see everything that's in the black here on whichever screen you're looking at, okay? I'm gonna walk you through my life after I graduated in 2001. Starting with a cute picture of me and my friend Khalil from CRS graduating in 2001. <laughs> I then went on to intern and eventually get a job at BET News, which is, uh, you know, just go across left to right. Then I went to WKZ. Both these were associate producer and production assistant jobs. See, I came into this school wanting to be a new house. Anybody remotely sound like that? Any hands? Let me see your hand. Higher! Higher! Okay, say what you just said. Okay. So, the reason I wanted to point this out is because you too can have a career <laughs> in whether it be television, radio, film, whether it be marketing and production. You too can do this. I'm going to walk you through how I did it.